the video games and uh, movie industries, they rely heavily on digital media. So that's 3D models, textured with animations, basically the kind of art that you see in virtual worlds. It's expensive and time consuming to make. As computers are getting faster and have more memory, this problem's just getting worse. The reason why it's so expensive is because art creation is not being automated. It's still the same basic process it was a thousand years ago. Back then, it, people painted things with wooden sticks, now they do it with plastic sticks. As opposed to like accounting, where spreadsheets automate all the tedious math, Word processing, where spell checkers, grammar checkers, you know, automate all the, all the tedious, you know, that kind of proofreading. We want to be that for art, where we basically help you automate and proofread your art creation. Our solution is a new type of artificial intelligence that mimics human-like artistic creativity. Our system takes images and 3D models and it uses them as inspiration to imagine basically infinite more in a process that is either completely automatic or you as a person can guide in a highly subjective, high-level way. We can and have gone to all of the biggest players in the field and there's a huge appetite for this kind of software. We're solving a major problem. So these are companies that have a massive problem and they have money. So the plan is to work with them closely, go from a thing that works to a thing that works comfortably in the art production pipeline. Once we have a tool that's designed for, uh, for professional artists to do their jobs you know, quicker, better, easier, then the plan is to actually tackle the big picture. The big picture is put this on the cloud where we then extend it to everybody, people that aren't necessarily professional artists or even artists at all. We imagine a system where we can democratize our creation 